Hello everyone, uh, good day okay, wherever you are on the surface of this art. I welcome you to my uh, study vlog. Today's topic is a 14 hour study vlog. Okay, how study routine changes okay, the brain. Okay, I repeat, 14 hours a study vlog. Okay, how study routine uh, changes okay, the brain. Okay, either we like it okay or not, uh, that as soon as uh, um, a student okay, dedicate himself or herself okay, to studying, Okay, there's a way that some populations of neurons, okay, that these populations of neurons become dedicated to that activity. So, what I'm going to really advise, okay, students all over the world is this, that there's a need for them, okay, if they want to have a do well in the education sector, there's a need for them to come up with a productive study routine. And what is a productive okay, study routine? Okay, it is a story routine that a student okay has decided to to put into practice almost on a daily basis. That on a daily basis, that student is expected to read his or her uh, book. And as a student, okay, dedicates himself, okay, herself to this okay study routine or to this uh, uh, productive uh, study routine. In the brain, there are some populations of neurons called concept neurons. Okay, these are neurons that are dedicated to education. They are neurons that are dedicated uh, to learning. So as a stu as that student okay puts into practice the productive study uh, routine, these populations of neurons okay become okay they they become stronger. Okay, their populations okay increases. Okay, as and as the population increases, okay, in the process there is um, a kind of a new cognitive okay map okay will be created in the brain. Okay, and this cognitive map is referred to as a neural uh, circuit. So for everything that we know how to do, if you know if you know how to sing, if you can uh, uh, deliver speeches okay pu publicly, if you know how to ride a bicycle, okay, if you know how to dance, do not forget there are neural circuits okay in your brain that are responsible for everything that an individual really uh, masters so the and uh, by extension if a student if a student decides to come up with a productive study uh, routine definitely in that student's brain okay um, it's going to the dedication will have to lead okay to the evolution of what what I call academic and neural circuit this academic neural circuit uh, will uh, be be, uh, be responsible Okay, for the encoding okay of new data okay of new information that a student okay uh, uh, maybe gets as a result okay of study as a result of daily uh, uh, learning. So it is important okay that if a student wants to do well in the academic sector, he or she needs to do 